Okay, got the mouse. I'll run for a quick little video, show you what, to get in, what this game's all about. Um, let me just come back out of this for a second. Back. Okay, so let's start menu. Uh, you've got play, collection, shop, extras, options, and logged in. When you log in, it gives you some Warner Brothers ID unlockables. So if you have the game on the mobile, you can unlock these stuff on the console version. Um, there's tons of things that you can unlock and if you have the console version you unlock these on the game again tons of things for you to unlock um, so if you have both of them great um, you have the option to buy credits uh, the whole the whole thing works on credits you have credits in order to rank up your characters buy more characters buy more perks for your characters sort of thing so you can make your characters stronger and better and um, you can buy them or you can choose to just get in the game and earn credits um, close that um, come back out of that. Um, if you go into play, um, you have, as you can see, these bars at the bottom. You have different um, battles that you can battle through to try and win um, and gain more credits, beat more characters, gain more characters, etc., etc., etc. Each level or battle has an um, array of characters that you have to battle through. At the moment, I'm doing this bonus one, which is right here. I think it's got about eight characters or eight battles, three characters each um, to battle through in order to rank up. Um, this is what I'm using to credit farm, what it's known as, just so I can get some more credits, um, so I can buy some more stuff. Um, in regards to buying stuff, click on this button here. Um, you can see the boosters, characters, and supports um, that can also be accessed through the shop. Okay. So, um, boosters, again, you can buy the starter pack, which I'm not going to do because I ain't spending nothing. <laughs> um, I might one day, who knows. Um, you can buy a silver pack, which gives you, um, all the time you buy a silver pack, it will give you a silver, oh, let me start at the bottom, bronze pack, um, bronze booster pack, 8,000 credits. Um, that gives you a bronze character, um, as well as um, some unlockables. Silver, again, a silver character unlockables, or you can go for the gold at 75, which is once per day. Or 100 if you have more credits to spend um, again gives you a gold character and some bonuses um, so if we look at the characters you can see there's tons of characters so all these ones here you can see the ones with all the bronze these are all your bronze characters and you can see they've got a um, damage and they've got a life okay so they all as it goes up they get stronger and stronger and stronger after that you have your silver characters, you can see the life and the damage as well as how much they cost is a lot more. Um, you can see they start off with the bronze characters at 8000 um, and your highest bronze character is, where is that one, is Green Lantern New 52 which is 12000. Hence the reason why buying the bronze booster pack can work out in your favour. Same thing with the silver, lowest at 35 and the highest silver is who have we got we've got doomsday regime at 51 so again buying a silver at 35 can benefit you um, lastly is the gold ones um, the lowest being um, black adam regime at 133,000 so buying a boat a gold at 75 or even 100 works in your favor you can see the strongest is superman at 220 um, Next to that you have the support, which is, well they range from 300, but these are all in aid to make your characters and make the game easier for you to play. Um, I'm not going to go through them, there's tons. Obviously if you get a game you can go through each of them. I'll show you one for example, which is this random one here. Um, for cyborg, 10% damage for cyborg characters, it costs 4,000 credits or you can earn it throughout the game. Um, so it works in your favour to play the game, earn these stuff, unlock the booster packs or buy the booster packs and go as far as you can. Um, extras, what do we have in extras? We have the credits, you have your achievement which is linked to your game centre. Um, so you can see all the achievements that you can unlock throughout the game. Again, there's quite a few to unlock. It makes it fun to play the game and do these challenges. Help is help. Um, so you can look through all that stuff if you want to. Um, more from Warner Brothers, just other games that they do and rate. Um, what else is there? Options. Options, you have your basic options. Nothing really much to talk about. Okay, 
so playing the game at the moment I am on the bonus level um, I'm just boosting up um, well I'm, I'm using my characters to get them all to at least a rank 20 they all start off at rank 1 um, but I'm trying to rank them all up to get to at least 20 so I can do all their super moves um, they all have different set of moves I'll Batman. show you Batman for example um, his tactical genius is Batman and his teammates deal 25% more damage so great character to have um, as you can see he's ranked 20 um, near enough halfway through coming up to rank 21 um, so as I said they've got three sets of moves so you've got your move number one you've got your move two and you've got your third move um, you have that initially you unlock this second move at rank five and you unlock this one the third move at rank 20 so I've only just been able to unlock that move so I'm very happy um, making your character stronger um, you can use your supports so you've got your health support and you've got your damage support um, you can buy them or you can earn them you also have your energy support um, as well as that you can upgrade the strength on all your first second and third items by buying them or you can earn them through the boldness booster packs or throughout the game um, so again they make them stronger and stronger each time you use them as you can see the damage on these can be tremendous each time you play a game you use up your energy okay so you, you can have a recharge of energy by buying it um, or you can just wait over time and it will build up itself um, I've got 19 I try to keep them just so in case of emergency I just want to actually use them recharge my characters try not to recharge if you've got like I don't know two or one or even halfway wait until you got at least half of one or at least one and then you can recharge it fully it, it's a waste if you don't use it in the, um, in the right time um, say so you got three characters they've got the strength they've got a the recharging so um, this one costs two charges to fight so you're gonna see them all go down by two and now I'm gonna fight these guys Whew. so it's been quite a long video but I'm trying to be as descriptive as possible so you can get as much from it as possible um, so as you can see I've got three characters here I've got one two three and I can swap them through whenever I want just by tapping on each one I've also got the bars at the bottom here one two and three I haven't got three on any of these characters here so I can't use them I've only got two on those so I can only use them so you can see that one just went up um, it goes up by damage and by you hitting your opponent and connecting a hit if you get a block then you won't really get anything but the enemies generally do um, controls are very simple for the iOS um, tap for a light hit or you can swipe back or forward for a heavy hit um, tapping it or swiping it multiple times you perform a combo one two three and sometimes you get the option to do an additional additional hit at the end to gain more power to gain more damage um, when you're ready in your own time you can tap one of these buttons and do what it tells you to do on the screen so I'm going to tap at the right time and I perform a damage hit on the opponent to block two fingers on the screen and you block the character's moves um, the opponent's moves um, the same thing with the enemies you won't see their numbers flash one two and three but you'll see when it gets to a certain bar that they'll probably try and use a uh, move against you at the top is your life and the enemy's life and again their characters on the sides there um, depends on the characters you have you have you can um, you've got like your supports so I've got um, Nightwing and I've got um, Green Arrow so sorry Green Arrow and Nightwing so their supports will help me play in this game uh, I'm gonna do my move number two now um, and you can see substantial amount of damage done dealt there but I had low life so I got knocked out um, depends on your, your characters and how much you've ranked them up will show how much damage you're able to do on each character so it's always good to build up your character as strong as possible and then you can take them out quickly if I had Batman now I could probably defeat Batman because he's really strong he's got great life I could beat these characters in about 10 20 15 seconds if, if that at most um, so it's good to just keep playing have fun and enjoy the game as much as possible but personally I love this game um, collecting these cards um, making the most out of your characters um, and just having fun really um, yeah, I, I, I can't say how much I, I don't I, I love playing this game um, 
with each character um, you're able to buy additional cards to again rank up your character's strength and, and life bonus so again um, where you might just have one um, green arrow you can buy or you can earn another green arrow card um, which makes him stronger again so um, yeah as you can see um, once your character gets defeated or once you defeat a character um, they have an X which means that that person can't be tagged in again um, so it's always good to use your characters wisely and know which characters you're going to be using against your opponents so you can utilize their moves um, for someone like um, Harley Quinn who I'm facing right now she has the ability to increase her health increase her damage or damage your opponent so again using your characters wisely is always a good thing to do um, but as I said before um, I, I love this game <laughs> um, so I'm gonna end that video there I'm just gonna quickly beat these guys because they're not hard at all uh, let me just deal with this guy quickly uh, so I can show you the ending oh let me just change them quickly deal with that one two three and it's all for you green arrow good night um, once you've beaten a character you can see your time and damage and you can see how much XP you've earned on each character and how much credits you earn for that level again I'm trying to reach about 75 so I can buy another gold um, tap on the back of your character you can see how much you need again or if you want to add additionals to your characters as I said you can't unlock this one until you get to rank 20 so only 17 so I've got a bit of a way to go as you can see you don't really earn a lot depends on the game on the mode that you're doing but I hope I've um, explained enough about this game for everybody and I hope you guys get this game and enjoy it like comment and leave your feedback um, below thank you